welcome to curry electronics so today we are starting a video series on embedded c it will have around 30 to 40 videos based on embedded c once you go through all this you will be able to write good microcontroller programs the microcontroller programs means it can be for pic microcontroller or your favorite arduino or 8051 based microcontrollers there are many are there Dif many uh, microcontrollers and uh, different development platforms are there so i'll be focusing more on giving you embedded ca idea and how to use them in real applications so to show you i'll be using different uh, ides that is code block you can install code block for c as a c compiler uh, then uh, keel ide for uh, 8051 and arm microcontroller uh, for the pic microcontroller we will go with the mp lab x ide so I, I'll be changing uh, to show you different programs and different concepts. I'll be changing over these IDs. You don't worry about those things. Just try to understand. Later we'll have a, a video series on the microcontroller with a practical uh, board. So now let's focus on the embedded C. So this is the first video. Here we have to see how is the basic structure of a C program? So a C program, you might be knowing already, how does it look? It will have some header files. Uh, that is, let's start with hash, include, standard, io.h, input, output.h. This is a header file. Then, all C programs should have one main function that is like this main then there is a curly braces so whatever is going to be there in the application everything is going to be in between these two curly braces then what is there there will be let's take a simple a normally if it is a desktop application what is there we will have a print print f i like c backslash n for the new line and uh, return we have to return so we will write return return zero so this is the a very simplest c program here what is there this is the this, this print f function it's a predefined function and it is there in the standard io.h header file header file so to call this printf function we are using the standard io.h we are using that header file that standard io.h header file some more things comes before this main we can declare uh, what is meant by uh, variables uh, functions all that not let not go there now what about a um, embedded c embedded how, how does a embedded program looks we are we are not going for the general c we are more concentrating on the embedded c so that we can write programs in embedded c what happens we'll have a, a main function a main so usually i'll write void main so there is nothing to return then we'll have two curly braces right so everything will be inside these curly braces then we should have a infinite loop uh, generally what we do what we use is the while one while one that means when this condition is true execute whatever the code is here instead of while one we can use for also this also there for okay so while one uh, this is the method of a microcontroller program that is the embedded program it will have an infinite loop so whatever it is doing 
that infinite loop functions will be inside the while one and there the corresponding curly braces so that is how uh, the the program we will start learning about the embedded programming so this is the code block ide also with the c compiler now this is the simplest program i have written here that is the hash include standard io.h then the main function then as printf i like c that what is the use of backslash in to come to the next line if you run this what we are getting i like c you are getting so i wanted to write a while one here but let's let's do it in a and a which compiler with the microcontroller compiler we will do that so this is this is this is the just starting of the embedder c so now it will be a continuous it's a continuous uh, series of videos so i hope this will be useful to you uh, to write some microcontroller programs so that with the time you will be mastering the embassy programming for microcontroller thanks for watching